Welcome to our journey through the solar system, a vast and fascinating expanse of space that holds eight unique planets, each with its own wonders waiting to be discovered. In this video, we will take an in-depth look at each planet and its moons, exploring their history, composition, and interesting facts. So sit back and get ready for a tour of the solar system. Mercury Mercury is the smallest planet in our solar system, and it orbits closest to the Sun. It is heavily cratered and has a rocky composition, with a thin atmosphere that is constantly stripped away by solar winds. Despite its small size, Mercury is a geologically active planet, with many of its craters formed by volcanic activity. Due to its proximity to the Sun, Mercury has a short year of just 88 Earth days. It has no moons. Although Mercury is the closest planet to the Sun, it is not the hottest planet in the solar system. That title goes to Venus due to its thick atmosphere and greenhouse effect. Mercury has the longest day of any planet in the solar system, lasting 176 Earth days. Because of its proximity to the Sun, Mercury's surface experiences extreme temperature variations, with temperatures ranging from minus 290 degree Fahrenheit at night to 800 degree Fahrenheit during the day. Venus Venus is often called Earth's sister planet due to its similar size and composition. It is covered in thick, poisonous clouds that create a greenhouse effect making it the hottest planet in our solar system. Despite its harsh conditions, Venus is also an active planet, with volcanoes and earthquakes occurring regularly. Venus rotates in the opposite direction to most planets in the solar system, which means that its day is longer than its year. Venus has no moons or rings, which is unusual for a planet of its size. Venus has the most volcanoes of any planet in the solar system, with more than 1,600 known volcanic structures. Earth, Earth is our home planet, and the only one we know of that supports life. It has a rocky composition and is the fifth largest planet in the solar system. Earth's atmosphere is composed mainly of nitrogen and oxygen, and it is the only planet with liquid water on its surface. Earth's moon is the largest relative to its planet in the solar system. Earth's magnetic field, created by its spinning molten core, protects us from harmful solar radiation. Earth's atmosphere is constantly changing, with gases like oxygen and carbon dioxide being cycled through the biosphere and atmosphere in a delicate balance. The highest point on Earth is Mount Everest, which stands at 29,029 feet or 8,848 meters tall. Mars. Mars is often called the Red Planet due to its rusty, red appearance. It has a thin atmosphere and is home to the largest volcano and deepest canyon in the solar system. Mars is a popular target for exploration with many missions sent to study its surface and search for signs of past or present life. Mars has two small moons, Phobos and Dimas. Mars has the largest volcano in the solar system, Olympus Mons, which stands at a towering height of 16 miles or 25 kilometers. Mars has the longest canyon in the solar system, Vales Marineris, which is over 2,000 500 miles or 4,000 kilometers long. Jupiter. Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system, with a diameter more than 10 times that of Earth. It is a gas giant and is known for its iconic Great Red Spot, a giant storm that has been raging for centuries. Jupiter is also home to some of the most interesting moons in the solar system, including Io, Europa, Ganymede and Callisto, which are believed to have subsurface oceans of liquid water and may be capable of supporting life. 
Jupiter has the most moons of any planet in the solar system, with over 92 known satellites. Jupiter's great red spot, a massive storm in its atmosphere, is so large that three Earths could fit inside it. Jupiter's magnetic field is the strongest of any planet in the solar system, and it creates intense radiation belts that can be dangerous for spacecraft and astronauts. Saturn. Saturn is the second largest planet in our solar system and is also a gas giant. It is known for its beautiful rings, made up of ice and dust particles. Saturn's moons are also fascinating, with Titan being the largest and the only moon in the solar system with a thick atmosphere. Saturn's rings are made up of countless individual pieces of ice and dust, ranging in size from tiny particles to chunks several meters across. Titan, one of Saturn's moons, has lakes and seas made up of liquid methane and ethane, rather than water. Saturn's moon Enceladus has geysers that spew water and other material into space, leading scientists to believe that it may have a subsurface ocean that could support life. Uranus. Uranus is a nice giant and is the seventh planet from the Sun. It is tilted on its side, and its moons and rings orbit around its equator. Uranus' moons are small and icy, with Miranda being the most interesting due to its strange appearance and history of geological activity. Also, it has a highly varied terrain, with cliffs up to 12 times higher than those in the Grand Canyon. Uranus is the only planet in the solar system that rotates on its side, with its poles lying almost in the plane of its orbit. Uranus' rings are much darker and less reflective than those of other gas giants, making them difficult to see from Earth. Neptune. Neptune is the eighth and farthest planet from the Sun. It is also a nice giant and has the strongest winds of any planet in our solar system. Neptune's largest moon, Triton, is one of the coldest objects in the solar system and is believed to be a captured Kuiper Belt object. However, Triton is slowly spiraling inward towards the planet and is expected to eventually be destroyed by tidal forces. Neptune is the windiest planet in the solar system, with winds that can reach speeds of over 1,000 200 miles per hour or 2,000 kilometers per hour. Neptune's great dark spot, a massive storm similar to Jupiter's great red spot, disappeared in 1994 and has not been seen since. In conclusion, our solar system is a vast and fascinating place with eight unique planets that each have their own distinct characteristics and features. From Mercury, the smallest planet closest to the Sun, to Neptune, the farthest planet from the Sun and the windiest planet in the solar system. Each planet has its own story to tell. We have also learned that there are many interesting facts about each planet, such as the fact that Venus has more than 1,600 known volcanic structures and Saturn's moon Enceladus may have a subsurface ocean that could support life. As we continue to explore our solar system, we can only imagine what new discoveries and revelations await us. Thank you for joining us on this tour of our solar system. We hope you enjoyed learning about each planet and discovering some interesting facts about them. There is still so much to explore and discover in our solar system and we look forward to continuing to learn more about the mysteries and wonders of our universe. Remember to keep looking up at the sky and keep exploring. Thank you for watching.